Hello traders and welcome back to this video. It's Leonard here and in today's video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to actually set partial take profit or you know stop loss, all right, on your positions using the Bybit exchange. Now, everything I'm going to do here will be using the Bybit app, all right? The same thing I'm going to do here will be applicable if you are going to use the web version of the exchange okay so now to set either partial take profit or partial stop loss and all of that it means that you already have a position running okay so it is assumed that you already know how to trade on the buy bid exchange if you don't know how to do that then there is need for you to see other videos we have created and on how to trade features on the buy bid exchange now, if you don't have a Bybit account already, Bybit is one of the best exchange when it comes to derivative trading in terms of fee and a lot of other benefits you stand to gain when trading with Bybit. So make sure you use the link in the video description to sign up for an account if you don't have one already and join my Telegram group, okay, join the trading community to learn more from the community as well, all right? So if I scroll down here, you see that I already have a position running, okay? And then I have not set my take profit, neither is there any trailing stop or thereabout, okay? Now to be able to set um, partial take profit or partial stop loss on the existing running trade, all you need to do is just to click on the set TP and SL, okay? So if I just go ahead and click on it, it pops up this dialog box. When this dialog box comes up, by default, what you have here is to either close the entire position when you are setting your take profit level or your stop loss level, okay? This is the one you have by default. So what you want to do if you want to set partial stop loss or partial take profit, all you just need not to do, okay? If you want to close part of your position when it hits your stop loss level or when it hits your take profit level, what you now do is to use the partial position option okay so i'll go ahead and click on the partial position option and it will bring you here all right now that you're on this interface you can see that it is a new feature so if your buy bid app is not up to date you want to make sure that you update the app for this to be available on the app okay so if i come in here i will now decide the percentage okay you can see i can use the slider here to decide the percentage of the amount of position that i want to close okay if this position goes in my favor i want to take partial profit all right meaning that i don't want to close the whole position i want to take part of those profit close part of those uh, you know margin and then allow the trade to still run so all i just need to do if it is 50 percent, i click on the slider so it means that it will close half of my okay account and then take profit for me there or okay i can do um 20%, okay, 80% and all of that or 200%. So I just go ahead and say, okay, let's do this for 50%, okay? And then where do you want to take the profit or this partial profit, okay? You will not determine the price of the particular token you are, uh, you are trading. When it gets to so, so, so level, you want to take partial profit, you go ahead, okay? I can do 5% using the default slider here that Bybit has already made available for me okay it means that if the price gets to this level i want to take partial profit of uh, you know 50 percent i have set here okay it means that part of my positions will be closed and i will take profit there all right but if it continues to go against me the same thing you do for take profit is the, the same thing you do for stop loss okay so if i set stop loss here it means that it is equally working with this same partial position that i've set up here which is 50 percent of my account okay so you scroll down here you go ahead and put if it is five percent you want to raise ten percent and all of that you go ahead and do that and then by bit will let you know that if this goes okay against you by minus 45 percent remember the five percent the percentage you see here is not with leverage okay but once you click on it it tells you because you are using 10x leverage it means that five times 10 okay which will give you what you have here so approximately 50 percent if this market or this uh, uh price goes against you by 50 percent you are going to lose that amount of money and all of that so after that you go ahead and click on confirm and that will be confirmed so that is how you take partial pro profit or you know close partial um, um position of your ongoing trade okay now if you want to do for the entire account okay whatever um take profit level and stop loss level you set it it means that when that is triggered the entire position will be closed 
okay the entire position will be closed so if you hit my stop loss level the entire position will be closed and if you hit my take profit level the entire position will be closed then if you want to do partial take profit or partial stop loss you go and click on the partial option okay just click on the partial option and then you determine you will not select the position you want to close with is 50 percent 80 percent 70 percent okay just use the slider and you know specify that then you can now set the take profit and stop loss level and go ahead and click on confirm all right so that is how you take partial profit okay um whether it is partial take profit or partial stop loss that is how you set that using the buy bid app once you have a trade that is running all right so if you like this video give it a thumbs up if you have gained value from the video give it a thumbs up and if you are new to the channel support us by subscribing to the channel when you subscribe hit the notification bell that way you will be the first person to be notified each time we publish videos like this on the channel okay if there is any video idea anything you want me to do make videos on okay just use the comment section to let me know and definitely the next video will be according to your request so that is it and i'll see you in my next video